When trading, it's important to understand what moves the markets. This can help you determine the best time to open a position, take your profits, or cut your losses. Price movement is affected by supply and demand. If more people want to buy a share than sell it, demand outstrips supply and the price rises. If supply is greater than demand, the price falls. But what makes traders want to buy or sell shares? Any significant news from a company will impact interest in its stock. Positive news suggesting growth may see the price rise, while losses or bad press could mean a fall. Examples of company news include quarterly earnings, launching a new product, change of management, redundancies, or a merger or acquisition. Another major factor is trader sentiment, the overall feeling investors have about a company's future performance. This is often psychological. Investors can be influenced by the mood of the markets and what other traders are doing. Finally, external factors beyond the company's control can cause movement. Changes in legislation or public opinion. The health of the economy, for instance, Interest rates or employment figures can cause movement. Or broader factors like natural disasters, climate change and conflicts. So now you have a better understanding of why stock markets move. What next? Keep a close eye on the companies you trade without losing sight of the bigger picture. Read the company's annual report and press releases. Check out competitors. Are they gaining market share? What about the supply chain? Will oil prices affect distribution costs? By keeping up with the latest news and understanding how different markets relate to one another, you might be able to turn periods of volatility to your advantage.